Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Test Drive Unlimited PlayStation 2 Edition. Today is episode number 32. If you guys do want to keep up to date with the TDU PS2 series, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And also, don't forget to check the description for our social links. We have Twitter, Discord, and Instagram. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Right, so it is a new day today, a new recording session, and we are going to carry on with clubs today. We've got a load of them to do, um, so we're only going to do clubs. Uh, I think I'm going to do eight of them today. And we are starting off with the GT Racers Club. Um, so this one has GT cars. Uh, but which ones we can use, I do not know, so we're going to have a look. Uh, so I can use the Noble M400. I can use the Gallardo. Um, what else can I use? I can use the Skyline. Exige. Oh, I don't want to use the Gallardo again, though. Do we use the M400? Yes. Let's use that, then. Uh, so first off is the Ford Mustang GT. Um, and then we're going to be going against a Aston Martin, a Lotus, another Aston Martin, Alfa Romeo. And then finishing off with the Lamborghini Gallardo, the car that I said I didn't want to drive. Uh, so let's do this. Ford Mustang, here we go. Yes, let's start the race. Right, here we go. Look at that Mustang, it looks so nice. But we're in a better car. <laughs> Look at it go. It's just gone. The Mustang is nowhere to be seen already. Quite a, uh, quite a short race today, this one, in this club. Oh, come on, nice. Slow down. Perfect. Nice. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Watch it. Careful. We got a tiny, tiny bit of off road penalty so far. Nice. This is some of my base, uh, best racing yet so far. And especially for a start of a recording session, it doesn't normally go this well at the start. But there we go. One minute and six seconds for that race. Very good. Uh, 3,375 credits. Awesome. Right, let's have a look and see what the next vehicle is. So the next one is the Aston Martin V8 Vantage. Let's go. We're going to be racing against Sue for this one. I'm going to sue you. Haha, <laughs> funny. Not funny. <laughs> Here we go. Aston Martin V8 Vantage. It's quite a nice looking car, actually. Quite like the uh, V8 Vantage. 3.4 miles for this one. So uh, I need to try and get as much of this game finished as possible over the next two days. Uh, because on Wednesday, I'll be... Obviously, Tuesday for me today will be my first live stream. Uh, today's not Tuesday. Today's Monday. But tomorrow is going to be my first live stream back on YouTube for about two months now. Uh, it's been a while. But uh, it's going to be exciting to come back and do a couple of live streams. Um, but also, we're going to have a lot of fun with those, hopefully. Uh, they're not going to be like video live streams like I did before. Um, they're just going to be mess around live streams that get deleted. Um, but it's going to be quite fun. It's going to be quite enjoyable. Oh, here we go. Let's go. Nice. Um, but yeah, we're going to have, hopefully, a bit of fun with those. Um, but also... Um, oh, get out of the way. I'm going to have to redo my setup on Wednesday. So I'm going to have a much better setup uh, in a couple of days. 
I'm going to have a lot more room and a lot more space. So when I'm recording, I'm a little more comfortable. Because at the moment, I sit in the corner of my room. Literally. Right in the corner. So we're going to end up with like a proper setup. There we go. It's gone really well so far, this race. Ah! Watch it. Perfect. Turn left. There we go. Ta-da. And there we go. Across the line. 1 minute 46.294. That's a very good time, actually. Very fast. Right. So next up is uh, the Lotus Sport Exige. Let's do this. I quite like the Lotuses as well. Oh, those engines though. They sound so good. And then you just get my Noble coming in with the... I don't know why, but when I made that noise, I closed my eyes and I wasn't actually looking where I was going. And surprisingly, uh, the Lotus was the one that crashed out of all of that. Come on, come on. We've got the weird bin fire trucks behind us. I can't tell what they are. The weird thing is about this game as well, is there's so many of those yellow trucks, right? If they're fire trucks, why on earth does Hawaii have so many fires then that you need that many? And if they're bin trucks, how much fucking rubbish does Hawaii have? <laughs> they're chatting. They are chatting. Come on, let's go. Oh! That was close. Very nice. Very good, very nice. Yeah. Okay. A little bit hyper today. <laughs> Just a little bit. I've also gotten, right? I've also gotten uh, into the game of fuel. <laughs> Um, I've ordered myself one of those like shaker cups and I didn't get G Fuel because that comes from America and it's really expensive to get a ship to the UK um, but I did get Sneak which is basically the British alternative um, and I'm going to be trying some of that um, hopefully it tastes good um, but yeah going to be giving that a little bit of a try I got so many videos to edit tonight it's ridiculous Oh, careful there. All right. And here we go. Across the line. First place. 2 minutes 35.560. That's a very good speed for this car. Very good time. And this is only the first of 8 clubs for today. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to edit all the footage that I've had before to this point. And then I'm going to do like 2 clubs per video for the for 4 videos of this. And then after that it's just anything goes again. Um, but next up is the Aston Martin Vanquish S V12. Let's go see how well we can destroy this car. Destroy it with a sledgehammer. Alright, let's go. And we're off. Bye, Toby. Oh, no. <laughs> that was karma for... Uh, Paying attention to behind. Oh, 
Oh, no, no, okay. Oh, we're losing control of the car. <laughs> I was snaking all the way down that road there. There was no control whatsoever. Awesome. Oh, come on. Woohoo! Weave in between that traffic there. That shows skill to pay the bill. <laughs> I tried not to say it. It was like one of those TikToks. Don't say it, don't say it, don't say it, don't say it to pay the bills. Ah, fuck. There we go, though. Oh, that, that didn't go well. <laughs> Massive crash at the end there. And we've got the audio glitch again. Nice. Right, so that is three of the cars taken. Oh no, four cars. Oh shit, we've done more than I thought. Okay, so next up is the Alfa Romeo 8C Compezione. Uh, we're going against... Is that Jorge? George? Jorge? I don't know. But we're going against Jorge. We'll call him Jorge. I've forgotten what car we're going against now. Alfa Romeo. That is it. <laughs> How can you forget in like five seconds? I love this game so much. Genuinely playing this game is sort of an enjoyable experience because of the fact that it's coming back to like childhood memories and stuff like that. Games that I played as a child and thoroughly enjoyed, mind you. Um, oh, a little bit of contact through there. But those kind of games I enjoy big time. Um, I really do. Oh, that was good. But there are also some games that I didn't enjoy playing. Um, one game that I found, I bought, um, base, right. Basically, I didn't realize that um, back in the day, they made games for the PS2 because it was still so popular, but the PS2 and the PS3 counterparts were completely separate games, right? I didn't realize that. So uh, I went and recently, because I didn't have Xbox 360 with some of the games I had on PSP. Uh, I bought Get Out of the Way. I bought Need for Speed Pro Street on Xbox. Now I had the PSP version. I really enjoyed that. And then I played the 360 version. And I, for some reason, I did not like playing that whatsoever um, compared to the PSP version. So I don't know whether I'm going to buy like Need to be Pro Street on the PS2 because I know it will be the same as the PlayStation Portable version and play that. I don't know. I really don't know. But I really do want to play it. Very nice. Oh, not very nice. Crap. Back on the road, please. Thank you. Oh, shit. I've got hiccups. Oh, no. Oh, they feel horrible. Jesus. <laughs> Why does the body bully us so much? Oh, there's a nice house here. This is actually one of my houses, I think. I think this is actually my house that I own. <laughs> oh, that would be so funny if it is as well. I think it is. Because I recognise that section of road. 
because it comes to a dead end and then you're at the uh, front door of my house. So, <laughs> uh, next up is the Lamborghini Gallardo Coupe. So, this is the car that we said, no, we're not driving. So, if I lose, well, we'll have to end up driving the Lamborghini. Right, let's go. And we're off. Jonathan in his Lamborghini Gallardo. Very nice blue colour, actually. Um, and us in our Noble. Doing really well, surprisingly. Um, for this being a rear-wheel drive car, uh, it does actually simulate sort of like acceleration. Um, acceleration. What is that noise? Um, acceleration stats are... Uh, sort of quicker if you've got a four-wheel drive car. Um, so I'm actually quite surprised that the Lamborghini got the worse off start. Because we were pulling away from the start. But yeah, a little bit surprised. I ain't complaining though. You ain't catching me complaining. Very nice. Uh, whereabouts is it we're going now? It just seems like mostly a straight road, so, I mean, not really much variation right now. Ah, come on, get back on the road, get back on the road. Thank you. It's now screaming <laughs> outside my window. <laughs> Oh dear. All right, come on, come on. One mile left to go. Ah, oh, that was a good slide. GG's all round. Or do you say GS? Because it's like, good slide. Or GD, good drift. Geometry dash. Nice, 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 nice. Is the V car rent a car? And, oh, I couldn't do a donut. It said I crossed the finish line beforehand. That's not fair. Why is the game bullying me like that? That shouldn't be allowed. Can I get my money back? <laughs> I'm joking. Um, but here we go. GT races. The club has been completed. Awesome. And we got a free upgrade as well, so uh, when it comes Your to one of the cars later, we can upgrade it. Very nice. Very, very nice. Alright, so we are on our way to the next club. Uh, we're about a mile out. Uh, and this one, I think, if I remember correctly... Oh! South to North. Okay, that's a new event unlock that we can uh, fast travel to now. Nice. Um, this one, I think, is all about European cars. So... Reached your destination. There we go. Uh, let's have a look. Ala Moana Race Club. Okay, this is fancy because this is like an actual custom club. It's not just a generic auto club thing. Um, oh, I see a McLaren F1. We're going to have to do it. Where's my McLaren F1? Are you joking me? Oh, there it is. Okay, I feel like, actually, what car have we got? So we're going against... Right, we're going half and half for this one. So we're going to take the... Caterham for the first three. And then we're going to swap to the McLaren F1. There we go. We can mix it up that way. I feel like that's a better approach. Um, and that way we can get a little bit more fun out of the start. It's not just going to be, now we're done. Because now we're done is not fun. Right, here we go. That is one of the weirdest car engines ever. And we are flying away from the TT Quattro. Now. That is really cool. Okay. Right, so down here, we're going to go this way now. Nice. Awesome. Right, 
we don't got far left. This car is very quick at accelerating out of the corners, so... And we're not spinning out either, so that's very good. This is one of those games you've got to get used to. You've got to get used to the driving mechanics before you can properly play it. Um, but the way the game is structured as well, it gives you the easier cars that it's not a problem to get used to gradually. But if you were thrown straight into this catering, you wouldn't be able to drive it at all. I wouldn't be able to drive it. And I'm like, I call myself a professional racing gamer. <laughs> That's bullshit. <laughs> That's just plain bullshit. <laughs> bullshit. No, but I I can sort of adjust to games a little bit easier than most people. Um, right, next up is the Alfa Romeo GTV6. Let's go. Um, so, yeah. I can adjust a little bit easier, but you still need adjustment. Like, I could go and play Gran Turismo after this, and I'll be braking way too late for the braking points. I'll start braking, like, on the corner, like I do in this game. I mean, this game, you sort of still have to slow down. It's not like Need for Speed, where you're just, like, tapping you around the corner. Nowhere near like that. Oh, this is another short race. No, come on, game. No, no. What's the interior of this car like, actually? Oh, this is fancy. Oh, I like this. This feels good. This genuinely feels good to drive. Uh, that doesn't know. Very nice. We've got 150 miles an hour down this road. Come on. Okay, that was good. Turn right. Can I do a little donut as well? Donut. You are driving in the wrong direction. Please turn right. Oh, go, go. <laughs> that gave me a heart attack then. It didn't, it wouldn't spin. It refused to spin. I imagine if I did get overtaken, that would have been the biggest karma in the world. I wouldn't even be able to complain because my ass would deserve that. Right, but next up is the Aston Martin Vanquish SV12. This is going to be the last race we take with the Caterham. And then we'll be swapping over to the McLaren. Is it Formula 1? McLaren Formula 1 or is it just F1? Because I presume it's like a Formula 1 inspired car. And then it's also been inspired by Le Mans because it's got LM. Which is even more interesting. Oh well. Right, let's go. Come on, can we get a bit longer? That's 1.4 miles. I know I've picked a catering, but like, don't bully me. I want a decent race length. I'm making YouTube videos out of this. This is going to be a short video otherwise. It's going to be very short. And then I'll cry. Because I can legally cry. Because the game would have bullied me. Ah, no. Woo! Nice. Okay, turn left. Very nice. Oh! Look at that. 48 seconds. Wow. Unbelievable. Oh, this is going to be a short video. I'm sorry for this. <laughs> I don't think this structure is going to go well. We'll see how it works out. Uh, so now what we're going to do, uh, swap over to the McLaren F1. Uh, and we are going to race against the Ascari KZ1. This is a very nice car, actually. Uh, quite enjoyable to drive. I do like Ascaris. Hate the Ascari track, though. That's a very horrible track in Gran Turismo. Oh, and I've just spilt coke all over me again. Lovely. Alright, here we go. And we're off. Come on, Dave. 
Uh, how unlucky do you have to be to end up with that name? Just Dave. You're joking. One mile. This is unbelievably short. Oh, no. Dave's about to beat us. In his Ascari. No, you're not, Dave. Stay back. I do like the McLaren F1. It's a very nice looking car. We do the drift early. Prove a point. 54 seconds for that. Jesus Christ. It's literally taken no time whatsoever. The loading time for the two... For the races, the two loading screens are longer than the race itself. Next up, Lotus Elise 111R. Let's go. I do like the Elise. It's a decent car. Me does likey likey. Right, here we go. I don't like that turbocharged noise though. Come on, 2.3 miles. <laughs> I want a long race. Give me something to actually work for. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Oof. Double crash, double contact. No! I, how do I recover from this? <laughs> We're all crashing. Ah, oh, this is this is comedy. This is comedy gold. Come on, this race would have been done by now if it weren't for the fact that we crashed three times. All due to traffic cars being assholes. At the next intersection, turn right. Come on. This car as well, the fact that it's rear-wheel drive is really interesting. If this was a four-wheel drive car when it came out, it would be the fastest car as of now as well. It would have been even faster than it is. It's ridiculous. That's very good though. 7,500 credits for that. Thank you. Thank you. That's good. Right, next up is the McLaren F1. We are in the Le Mans version. And they are in the normal version. I don't know what that was. That was just me, like, mumbling that. I shall not do it again, I promise. Right, because we're both in supercars, game, you've got to let me have a long race. If this is less than three miles, I'm jumping out of my window. It, uh, right, I'm jumping out of my window after this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Here we go. Awesome. Right, slow down, slow down. Oh, no, no, no. Come on. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Okay, not ideal. That is a long time off road there. Ah, oh, get back on. Woo! That wasn't good. That was not good whatsoever. See, I would normally cut the corner here. Ah! I'm not liking this one bit. I don't want to redo it again. Though, to be fair, it's only 2.4 miles. This is the event that made me jump out my window. <laughs> Very good. Very good race so far. That is two out of eight clubs down for today's session. Ta-da. Oh, you want a Spike C8 Spider T? We'll deliver it after you make some room for it. Awesome. 
I got myself a spiker. That is very nice. I'm still gutted that Spike had to shut down. But there we go. We are president of the Accolade Ala Moana. For our European cars only. Your itinerary is being recalculated. Recalculated route. Okay, cool. This is very good. Is what is it sending me to, by the way? Is it sending me to that event we found earlier? I think it probably is. Oh, sorry, coppers. Fine, I'll pull over. <laughs> I just have. I don't want to deal with the cops today. I don't want to deal with them. What are they going to give me? Three times multiplier. Three grand. Are you joking? How do you turn that down then? How do you get that lower? How? How? I should have ran away. That was not worth it. I wasn't even speeding. Actually, I might have been. I probably was at like 200 miles an hour. Rip me. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button or click on the merch link in the description. It would mean the world to me. And also, don't forget to check in the description for our other social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. So make sure to follow us over on there. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>